Any bid, fair, reasonable start. Surely, I was thinking you deserve a nice, reasonable offer. But if you don't bid, you can't buy. Auction day. Are you prepared? Do you have your checklist? Have you got your finance improved? Have you got a check ready uh, as a deposit for the day? And your proof of ID, and that can be as simple as a driver's license or a passport or a government issued card. And if you haven't someone bid for you, they will need to fill out an application on your behalf to bid for you. Next thing you wanna do is to get there 20 minutes early. Give you a chance to get orientated, settle into the, into the place, relax, look for the registry desk and the agent, then go over and register. You'll be giving a bidding number. Next, you wanna find a nice clear position where the auctioneer can see you and your number. What will happen next? The auctioneer will start calling out for a bid after he's read out the terms and conditions. My recommendation is to bid early and settle into the process. You'll be able to think much clearer once you've got that initial bid out of the way. Then stick to your financial limits and enjoy the process. Relax and bid strongly. Okay, if you have any more questions, you can contact Grant at LJ Hooker Narrabeen on 0438 261 600. I look forward to talking to you soon. First, second, third, final call at 225. Yeah. Congratulations. Well done.